So I guess what this video is really going to boil down to is can Daniel wander through a winter wonderland and actually find any birds to take photos of like he intended? Because I'm going to be pretty disappointed if I have to take pictures of just the city from here. Alright, we are here to take bird photos. Okay, so just realized I am totally blown out, so I'm going to throw the ND filter on and then we will continue. Alright, and that's better. I don't particularly like vlogging with the ND filter on simply because I can see my reflection instead of the lens, which is super weird. But we are here today to take bird photos until my hands can't take it anymore. Fortunately, there's not that much wind. I brought some better gloves today, but we're going to go out and I'm usually not a birder but I do happen to have the 800 millimeter on loan from Canon Finland right now. And we're headed over to a swamp area that has a whole bunch of bird lookout things. And we'll see if it's any good. I don't know if we'll find any where I'm going right now, at least the swamp area, since everything is, everything is covered in snow right now. So we'll see if we can't find a good location uh, over back there, way back there. Is where we took the portraits with the 50 millimeter and the 100 millimeter and super awesome spot if i don't find anything i'll just go over there and take some cool photos but yeah let's uh, dive into it we have some brave brave people over there yeah i would not walk now the 800 millimeter f11 is really really a daytime lens you cannot take this lens out and have any type of darkness going on because f11 is quite stopped down it uh, or up whichever way you want to look at it you're restricting the light so much but it does blow out the background despite being f11 simply because it is so focused uh, 800 millimeters is really out there and you're very much so able to blow out the background uh, depending on what your subject is and how far and close it is to everything And these should be the birds in the area. I, uh... Yeah, super crazy to be able to see all this beautiful winter, winter wonderland looking stuff. And then also smokestacks from a, a, I think coal factory? Whatever it is over there. Electric factory. And just absolutely beautiful out here. Like that. Crazy. It really shows how in tune Finland is with just nature being next to everywhere we live here. And this location is only about a 15 minute bus ride away from downtown Helsinki. Really, really cool to have all this available like that. Really reminds me of my home, Boise. Boise, Idaho had a very similar feel, except with mountains instead of swamps. The sun's out, it's awesome. So I think these are gonna be a dud here, these little stands. Um, there's pretty much nothing here except for snow, like tons of snow and then the tops of these things. They don't think are very appetizing or interesting for birds. So we're gonna head over to the forest area and see if we can actually put this lens to use. Cause I'm gonna be pretty disappointed if I have to take pictures of just the city from here. But it's been beautiful, really nice walk. So the good news is I can start hearing birds. Thus far all I've heard is crows. Which isn't really what I want to take pictures of. Hopefully we will be able to find something. Yeah, this is a nice little island with a whole bunch of cottages. These are people's summer cottages. There's about, I think there's something over a hundred here on this little island. 
super nice spot really close to the the city for those people that don't have time to actually go to a proper lake so i guess what this video is really going to boil down to is can daniel wander through a winter wonderland and actually find any birds to take photos of like he intended <sighs> disappointing at least it's beautiful at least it's beautiful Okay, so this area was a total and utter bust. I have not seen a single bird this entire time. Maybe I'll take some pictures of these people on the ice. You probably won't be able to see them with the wide angle. But they're way over there. So I guess we'll see. Uh, it's super cool to be able to see the city. Uh, this is going to be the next downtown of Helsinki, but for now it's just new development area. Anyways, let's see if I can't take some people photos then, if there's no birds. So, let's do that. I will be trying to find more birds. We're going to go to another location after this, but for now, people photos. I think I lost my tripod somewhere too. Oh my goodness, i got to go back and grab it. It's a grower. So I was able to get a few photos from here. Nothing that I'm particularly proud of, unfortunately. There wasn't really anything here, but some pictures and some stuff that's really far away, like those guys. Skiing? Yeah, they're way over there. And then that dude that's on the ice, probably can't see him. This guy that's on the ice way over there, and then a pack of birds, and then the one bird that's over there. So yeah, we're gonna go pick up my tripod I left and then head to another location. But yeah, this 800 millimeter, you can see like ridiculously far away. In the movies when you have them using like really ridiculous binoculars that are like futuristic. Yeah, that's what this lens feels like using when you're panning across large areas. And it's super tack sharp for being, you know, F11. And there's the tripod I left. All right. Back uphill. Okay, so just ran into another birder and they gave us some advice. Apparently there's a feeding section, or at least there's birds, nothing special, but it's over there. So hopefully 30 minute walk and we'll have some bird photos. Hopefully, because I'm, I'm decently disappointed with the tip that I got yesterday about this place. So onward. I'll see you over there. Someone has lost their eye cup piece. <clears throat> Funny things you find out here. Okay, so I just exited the last place and I really do hope that this is the right direction to be headed. I have no idea. I was just told over this way some way. So hopefully this works.
just fog with the lens. I'm breathing. <laughs> 